Welcome here. It's, this is your business career and wealth reading for um, the month of uh, um, January um, 2020. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful positive energy vibration. Um, let's look and see what's coming up for your wealth um, in the, this month. So as we notice um, for the people on the work floor, there's a lot of influence, a lot of the influence that is happening on the work floor. Whatever the issues is, I see judgment call over you, Aries. I see uh, in the third week, there is going to be a new, um, have a new start for some of you. So if some of you are looking for a job, I see that in the third week, there is going to be a new start. I see strive, a lot of strive on the work floor. And I see uh, futility. Futility is uh, um, the seven of swords. So I see some strive and deceptiveness that is going on with you, Aries. So whatever that is playing um, with you, Aries, I see some strive and uh, what is going on. As we look, we see the energy of uh, definitely influence, 888. I see an infinity, especially for the Aries that have business. There could be unseen things that is going to create uh, infinity for you, which is an infinity abundancy. So that is good. So especially people with work, it's as if uh, there is some unseen where the universal angels or guide are preparing infinity for you so people with business this is really really looking good it's uh, it's looking good in the first week so um it this is when we manifest and then it's in the eight to eighters and it's going to come down like february march so there is unseen infinity abundancy that is created for business people and it's going to be coming down now i see a lot of judgment calls is coming down on a young um a young man this young man is a pisces cancer or a scorpion whoever this young man is and however this young man is connected with you in business or on the work floor i see some judgment call coming down on this young man i see that um some of you in business have created this judgment call that is coming down because i see in business and work some of you are dealing with uh, um, an Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra. I see some of you have uh, um, do some really, um, um, yeah, unseen things that is transpiring. Strive. Um, some of you have some strive and um, strive with your um, at work, but um, for some of you. Um, in your business, I see you're planting something and the thing that you're doing is going to be, um, you know, it's as if your abundance is being marked. So let's say that you have a business and you have been striving, going, going, going with this business. I see that unexpectedly a lot of things is going to be revealed. Okay. So it's as if sometimes you have a business and you're pushing, you're pushing. I see some of you, you could be dealing with, in a, you could be in a, a small business or a small corporation. You're working for a small business and so, small corporation. There is the queen of swords. Whoever this person is, I'm seeing that some of you are going to be having a new start. Now, whoever this queen of swords is, uh, um, it could be someone who you have known that, but you know, there has been strife between you and this person. So I'm seeing judgment call coming down on the screen of swords. Whoever the screen of swords is, I see judgment call coming down on the screen of swords. So let's look and see. There's a lot of influence, whatever the influence is. I see the prince, the prince of this. Now the, the prince of this is that some of you are not seeing the truth about this, um, young, Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion. You're just not seeing who this person is. And I see you are going to want to have a start with this person, to work with this person. But I see this start is not going to happen because uh, it's as if uh, this person with this um, 
um, whether in business or in work with this young um, Pisces cancer or scorpion person it's as if they don't want to collaborate with you or they don't want to um, you know teamwork with you so there is a lot of strive I see you're going to be calling down judgment on this person but I don't think it's very honest to do that basically because I'm thinking that you yourself have been um, connected in situation I see you want a, a new start for it with a supervisor a older person but this older person doesn't want to have anything to do with you this uh, older person um, she she is keeping herself clear I see that because of whatever has transpired on the the work floor I see this older person realize that it's better um, to stay away from the strife that is happening so this person is an Aquarius Gemini or Libra and they are just standing away from the strife what is happening I see a lot of deceptiveness strive and deceptiveness on the work floor for you Aries so there is definitely a lot that is going on and I see some of you wants a new start with maybe a boss a supervisor or um, there could be some legal issues that you have and you want a new start but I see so many strive that is going on and so many issues and failures and situation that is happening that you know is it's a question does it really worth it and I think that is one of the question that you guys should uh, should really go ask to, does it really worth it the strive and the situation that is happening so I see a lot of you are going to be um, walking away um, from a project and walking away from your work whatever is transpiring and happening I see some of you walking away from your project and walking away from your work so however that is affecting you I see this up then for you guys now I see some influence that is created by a young Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn whoever this person is this person is coming up as a Virgo and I see a Virgo step in um, it could be on the work floor or um, if you have a business you're dealing with a young Virgo and this person step in and this person could be helping some of you out because it's someone who is pregnant so whatever you are doing in business in the first week um, it is going to be good because this this person um, this energy of this person that is coming in is actually bearing some good fruits okay this person is actually bearing some good fruits bringing in and coming in so this is absolutely going to be brilliant um some of you are could be dealing with this person on the work floor and uh, I'm seeing you bringing down a judgment call on this young lady and I, I the reason why you're doing it is because of a Pisces cancer or a scorpion and there is some scumbling on the work floor because I'm seeing a little jealousy um, because I'm seeing that some of uh, you just wants to have uh, some positive alignment of energies and I see it's a little bit of jealousy for this young lady that is going on and I think you have to basically give it um, you know basically give it a chance um, this person could help you to create abundance in your life okay now we see another energy of uh, this is the energy of a person coming in so in the second week going in the third week I see some of you um, if your boss is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion I see some of you really want to connect with this person and ask this person for a new start ask this person for a job but I'm I'm seeing that instead of your letting this person know that you need their help in whatever way it is on the work floor or what I see you're kind of playing against them so be aware of what is transpiring um whoever this person is I'm saying that the queen of swords is going to be like protecting this person because this the queen of swords is going to give this person a chance because if there was a legal issue between you and 
um, an Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra, or an um, uh, an issue on the work floor. I see that this person is going to be taken up for the side of the um, the young man um, for whatever the reason is. So whether it is it, it is on the work floor because I see you you want to bring down a judgment call. It's as if these two people. Or getting along good on the work floor and I see some of you want to be the judge and jury of these two people and there is the present that sometimes you know it is better to just walk away from things or let things flow and let the chips fall where they're supposed to do so this is the reason why you're having so much strive on the work floor I see some of you trying to find in a strength to deal with a supervisor um, this is an Aquarius Gemini or Libra this is a woman 45 years and older and this person is an Aquarius for some of you and for some of you this person could be and um, yeah it was definitely an Aquarius and I see um, it's as if some of you wants to um, connect to this lady and to and it's like no it's it's like this lady doesn't want uh, to connect um, or it's, it's like some of you are, have changed to our uh, to a different department and it's as if this person you could have known this person on the work floor but then you changed to their department and it's as if this person really doesn't want you to be there so there is a lot that is basically going in there is absolutely a lot that is um really going in here and whatever is to inspire i see you coming out uh, with the energy in the fourth week going in the fifth week uh, whether it's work or um, business uh, where there is some deceptiveness and I see that uh, the deceptiveness I see a lot of communications and I see that people are really seeing what has transpired so there is there is just so much coming in on the work floor because there was some deceptiveness at play. I see some of you is as if uh, a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, and a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion. These are young people between the ages of 25 and 45. You guys are dealing with these energies and these people. And I see some of you are trying to find strength to deal with some of these situations and issues that is transpiring. When we look at work, we see a um, strive, deceptive play behind the scenes at work. And it is, it is really what for you guys. So I'm going to take a look because I see some of you just walking away from the strive on the work floor. I see there is too much strive on the work floor and I see some of you just really walking away from the strive on the work floor and I see that you're going to be choosing for yourself okay whatever it is I see you definitely going to be choosing for yourself because there is just so much strive that is going on that you're thinking what is this I gotta I gotta make different changes I gotta make sure that the changes that is coming up is going to be good because there is so much some of you could be ending up with legal issues with um your company the possibility does exist so um whatever is transpiring be aware because there could be this conflicts could escalate in a legal issue okay so whatever is transpiring um um aries you gotta be aware of what is transpiring because the conflicts could be really, really turning out in a legal issue. But for the rest, I see that on the work floor is conflicts, but in, in business, I see that unexpectedly, like in the haters, um, manifesting of your business, I am seeing that your business, your project is going to be good. I'm seeing that positive alignment of energies is going to be coming in. So I want to say, um, have a nice month and if you want to extend it reading um, please um, use the link below to connect with us bye